What's up guys, welcome back to my Turbo S and welcome back to a completely different style of video. We are going to be doing something today which uh, I don't know if it's been done before, I've certainly never seen it before and this is going to be the first time I try it. I'm with Toma, uh, Toma who's uh, here next to me that I uh, met through a mutual friend through Instagram and I heard uh, Toma's story and I wanted to share it with you guys. So today we are doing uh, something very special, um, we are going to be driving um, this car. Yeah. Uh, Porsche Turbo S, so nearly 600 horsepower. <laughs> and uh, a lot of power. We, we are going to be driving it um, in third person view, yeah. which is a uh, like video game view uh, you see in GTA 5, for example. Exactly, yeah. So we're going to basically have a, a virtual reality mask on our eyes when driving this car. Yeah. And the reason we're doing that is um, to kind of simulate but also to raise awareness, is what we're trying to do for a, uh, uh, an illness which uh, you unfortunately um, are a victim of and that uh, we want to raise awareness of to be able to one day eventually um, curate a, a solution and a, a cure for this. Um, so yeah, so I, I'll let you explain a bit more. You, you, you probably can do that better than I can. Okay, so basically I have a genetic disorder which is called retinitis pigmentosa and it is uh, an inherited um, Genetic, genetic disease that causes blindness before age 30, unfortunately, for some cases. Today I have a visual feed that is very re reduced. It is about 95% reduced, so I can see like within a tiny hole uh, today. And um, basically I'm trying to, to raise a little bit of uh, money to be able to afford treatments uh, when treatment will be uh, available for me. Yeah, exactly. So there's a, uh, yeah, you, you, you've put together a, a crowdfunding page uh, of which there'll be the link in the description. And also you were, you know, taking part in studies to be an engineer. Um, and then obviously that was difficult with your vision deteriorating over the years. Um, and so you're starting up a YouTube channel, Instagram, everything that goes with it to A, uh, you know, be able to help fund potentially the, uh, uh, the cure that will hopefully arrive in the very near future, but also to raise awareness for this illness, which I personally was not aware of. Um, and uh, yeah, I think it's a great initiative that you're taking. You know, uh, I know that myself and a lot of the audience will want to support you in that. And I think that this idea of uh, uh, driving the video without, uh, driving the car without seeing what is in front of us is a really cool, fun idea to be able to um, yeah, raise awareness. So that is the goal of today's video. We're about to arrive on a big parking because obviously we can't do this on open roads. And uh, I mean, I think it will be an interesting experiment, but also I think we'll probably have a little bit of fun while doing it as well. We're gonna have a good laugh. Yeah, I, I hope so. Yeah. Okay, step one, put the aircon on. Right, now, first of all, I'm gonna try this pair of glasses, which you have dreamt up, right? This is your <laughs> creation yes. right here. And this simulates vision that you have today, correct? Correct. Um, so I want to kind of, yeah, experience this through through your eyes as best I can and kind of try and experience it myself and translate that to um, the people watching so they can have an idea of um, what this illness that you've been diagnosed with can, can represent. So this blocks off all light coming from up, from the top, from the bottom and from the sides and basically everything coming through the center as well. Ready? Ready. Oh, oh my God. Oh, wow. That's even more impressive than I thought. It's exactly what you were explaining to me earlier. It's you see just what is right in front of you. But like, I can only see one of my hands here. None of my hands. I can't see anything. And then right now I can see both. But right here I can't see. That's it, that's it. Yeah, and that's so that this is what you see now, right now. Yeah, I, I you know you know what? I actually have my driver license with this. <laughs> really? Oh yes, that's true. You told me you passed your driver's license. So that's what I'm gonna try and do then. <laughs> I'm gonna try and drive. I, I can't even see if I've got the handbrake on. Okay. Okay. Oh, I. This is insane. This is insane. And this is what your vision is today. And unfortunately, this illness could. It doesn't necessarily. We never know. But it could lead to even further deterioration of your. But of basically, your vision. if we do nothing from today, uh, it's possible that by age 30, I am 20 right now. So by age 30, uh, I lose uh, completely my, my sight. 
killed and that is what we're going to try and avoid <laughs> that's, um, yeah, that's... as much as possible because you know even though this is tricky and it's obviously taken me a while to adapt there you know this is still you know you can still see a lot around you you can still um you can still see faces you can still yeah. walk expressions yeah you can, yeah yeah because i have the the very fine details of vision but I, I, I lose like the, the you, overall. What's around, yeah. yeah. So you can see kind of right in front. I mean, look, for sure also, I mean, I'm sure you're, you know, unfortunately quite used to this now, but for me, you know, obviously just whacking these on straight away and trying to drive um, is, is pretty intense. But this is impressive and it puts in context for me and hopefully it will put in context for the people watching exactly what this illness can represent. I'm gonna park up right here. Yeah, I mean, this, yeah, we need to raise awareness about this because this, this, uh, we need to try and improve and change is my initial impression. But I'm glad we were able to kind of put it in context. But now the concept is we're going to try and drive as if we were in GTA. So you and I on equal turf driving this car with an FPV drone. So we're going to be in the car, but out the car at the same time. You ready? Sure. Let's go. Let's do it. Here we go. Okay. I'm parked. This is going to be one of the strangest things I've ever done. I really feel like I'm in uh, I'm in GTA. Okay, I feel like let's put Sport Plus mode on. <laughs> There's never been a more appropriate time for Sport Plus. Let's go left. Ready? Go. Oh, that is such a weird feeling because I can see. Oh my God. Oh, it does make you feel a little bit sick. I'm not going to lie. Okay, turn right. Whoa, okay, down. This car looks good. <laughs> <laughs> this is insane. Am I going to feel the pothole now? Oh, yes. So I see the car moving. Oh, this is this is like the craziest GTA feeling. Okay, wait, let's go. Let's go right here between the tree. Am I getting overly confident? Left. Oh, okay, got it. This should be hard for the for the drone to, to follow. Yeah, <laughs> I can imagine. But look. So wait, let me just do one test. Stop. Oh yeah. Oh, it's so weird. So I don't actually really need to move my head. Or do I? I don't get it. This is so confusing. My mind can't keep up with what's going on right now. So you, you still move your head to, to look right. But, yeah. <laughs> but you don't actually need it because uh, ah! you see from the above. What? Oh, this is this is a crazy sensation. I never thought I'd be doing this. Oh, should we try and do like a roundabout around this post? Okay, now I can't see the post. Whoop. Sorry. No, it's okay. Oh, I can't see. Oh, yes, I can see. Uh, I can kind of see. Okay, here we are. Are we going super slowly? Because for me, it feels like we're going kind of, you know, at a decent speed. We're about, I think, 10 to 15. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, let's go straight here. Oh, he's accelerating! He's accelerating! <laughs> Second gear! Oh, <laughs> yes! Oh, okay. <laughs> Down we go. I like having these little things here. It's like an obstacle. Shall we try and park it somewhere? Sure. Okay. Let's see. This feels about right. Whoa! Okay, wait, wait, wait. Reverse. I feel like in, we're in GTA and someone's just gonna come and, and steal the car at some point. That's parked, right? That works. Sure. Yay! We did it. Oh my God, this is so weird <laughs> when you take it off. <laughs> when you take it off, you feel like the sun is like... <laughs> oh my God, this is insane. You wanna have it, you wanna try? Sure. Let's do it. It's my you turn. ready? My turn? I, this is one of the weird, I can't believe I'm letting someone drive my car when with, with this on. <laughs> Basically, you're not going to be seeing anything. All you're seeing is a screen from the drone following us. You feel ready? Yeah, man. Yeah. You're already in drive, so there's nothing you need to do. Straighten up the wheel. Now you're straight. There you go. Okay. Mask on. Mask on. Oh. It's weird, right? I have to say, she looks very pretty. Yeah, right? I know, it looks so sick from that angle. Okay, 
We can start going straight, I guess, if you just lift off the brake. Oh god, it's already going. Oh! <laughs> this is such, this is so, it's almost, yeah. This, this is, is insane, this is insane. Right? I can't, I can't believe you are actually driving <laughs> from a drone. I know, right? You're just, driving a car from a drone, basically. Just think of the concept of this. I think it, this is like... It's amazing. weird, right? It's but see how you want to turn your head. Yeah, yeah, I Even do. though you don't have to. <laughs> yeah. You don't have to turn your head, but it really makes you want to. You're driving a Porsche Turbo S. Okay. Go straight now. There you go. Getting some speed. Oh, 11 kilometers an hour, 12. <laughs> is it what you expected it to be like? Kind of, but it feels faster yeah. when you're driving it from, from above. Oh yeah, oh for sure. I'm going to go around that tree. Yeah, because it's so weird because you're looking to the right, but you're turning to the left. <laughs> sure. <laughs> it's like you're, you're watching someone turn, but they're like this, you know? <laughs> it's like, this is so weird. Okay, I'm going straight. Yeah, go for it. Oh, here he goes! <laughs> See, when you accelerate, it's quite something. Oh, 16 kilometers an hour! Okay. There you go, turn left here. On the main road. Yeah, there you go. We are getting the hang of it. Yeah, sure. Now it feels like I'm, I'm literally like in a video game. Okay, wait, wait, wait. No, the, I, I see it, I see on it. On the right now. <laughs> I saw it coming towards us, like, oh shit. <laughs> okay, now you're good. It's like you're in a video game, but when you hit the, the wall, the wall is there. The wall is, yeah. <laughs> yeah, imagine explaining to the insurance company, like, so what were you guys doing? Well, uh, this is going to be a hard one to explain. Are you trying to park? Yeah, I'm trying, but I'm not, I'm not doing oh, well. Oh, it's just a start stop off. Okay, uh, go go park on the left there in one of these spots yeah, up on the sure. front front left. Let's see. Okay, there you go. You line yourself up well. Straighten up. Straighten up. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. A little, a little more, a little more. There you go. Bravo. Check. <laughs> nice one. Okay, now when you take it off. Oh wait, wait. I'm seeing some some nice scenery here. Oh, why is he going around? Oh, yeah. Now when oh, you take it off, come you'll down, see. Come down, come down, come down. This is insane. I know, right? When you take it off, it's the weirdest part. Because all of a sudden, you see, it looks so much bigger, the parking, right? When you're, yeah. you're on screen like that. When you see it for real, you're all of a sudden like, oh my god, that tree's kind of like right there. Whoa. Yeah. That drone went by that, super that, quick. That, that may be because um, when I, I came to the pole, yeah. You said be careful, but I saw it, it was like, oh, it's yeah, far away. Yeah, super far away, but actually it's kind of like right, <laughs> right there. Yeah, no, super, oh, look, the drone. So there you go. Can you drive a car as GTA? Yes, basically. Yeah, <laughs> we, we kind of did it. Nice one. Before we go, I want to have you test one thing. It's called launch control. Is the side, right isn't the side more, no, wide or? Is there... No, you're good, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? What? Oh mon dieu! Oh! <laughs> All the cameras behind! <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> well, that was pretty fun. We're on our way home now. Um, I just wanted to say thank you to you for, for enlightening me on, uh, on this topic. You know, I wasn't aware of this uh, illness as much as I feel like I should be. And I think being able to share it with others, you know, I think you can be proud of being a, you know, a voice potentially, you know raising awareness on the illness, but also for others that may be in a similar case to you, showing them, you know, they're not alone. Uh, you're out there, others are out there, and we're, you know, all gonna try and come together to try and raise awareness, raise funds, so that one day a cure can be made accessible to people like you. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. good. It was a fun experiment. Um, I'm gonna put all the links, guys, down below. Uh, if you guys want to donate, if you guys want to just follow your your upcoming videos and experiences on YouTube or, or Instagram, whatever it may be, I'm going to be watching and maybe one or two people from here as well. So thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> I'll see you uh, hopefully in the very near future. And uh, anyone watching this, if you aren't already, you can also subscribe to this channel 
or like this video because it does help the uh, the channel and we'll be seeing you again uh, very soon cheers guys bye bye, bye.